Uh, for me, being the younger brother, uh, I just always wanted to be better than him, you know. Uh, always wanted to be stronger than him, faster than him. Um, I think the whole time he knew he was stronger and faster, so he would mess with me a little bit and, and toy me on. But, uh, you know, to, to ultimately be three and four and try to imitate your older brother with playing baseball and, and following his footsteps was a huge uh, dream for me, and I, I, I can't believe both of us are here right now. That's great stuff. So, hey, this guy likes you, man. He looked up to you. Uh, good competition <laughs> in the house. Yeah, yeah, growing up, there was a friendly, little brotherly rivalry going on. Brotherly rivalry, is that right? Oh, yeah, sibling word. rivalry. We yeah, we make it work. But uh, yeah, Travis, uh, Travis was my shadow. Yeah, we were best friends growing up, and we're still great friends. Uh, we had lunch today and yesterday. Uh, man, now I'm just reminiscing about all the times that we had playing baseball in the backyard, the front yard, anywhere that we could. Um, it's really good memories coming to mind. I just bring a smile to my face, but. Uh, I'm really thankful that Travis is here right now and that we get to share this opportunity. Our mom's coming tomorrow. She's going to be hanging with us. It's a really special time for the family. Yeah. This guy's like Roy Firestone, man. He'd get me choked up over here. But i got to ask <laughs> you this. Um, Braves needed an emergency catcher earlier this season, and you ran down and, and told everybody, catching's in my, my blood. I did. You're proud. Did, you know that? did I tell you that? <laughs> You're proud of this guy. Oh, yeah. I mean, no, I don't know any many guys that could frame a ball better than Travis. Uh, but yeah, uh, Skip asked me if I could catch uh, because AJ had gotten ejected, Flowers was in there. We needed somebody to do the job, and I told him that I'd be happy to. And then, you know, hey, it's in my blood. Look at Travis. <laughs> yeah, it was perfect. Great stuff. Yeah, real quick, your proudest moment of your brother? Um, proudest moment was uh, I remember the day uh, his junior in high school when uh, he finally was able to commit to, to Pepperdine University. And, um, you know, both of us growing up together, I remember vividly remember both of us always looking at cars growing up um, checking cars out all the time because our parents promised us if you get a scholarship you get a car yeah. so uh, I remember right when he got the scholarship both him and I started looking at cars nonstop and we're, we're trying to pick out uh, a car for him but um, for him to ultimately uh, reach the goal that he wanted to in life was to you know go to a great college become a professional baseball player I mean um, I'll never forget that day where uh, where he was able to to follow his dreams and his aspirations in life and then ultimately go to Pepperdine. Now he's faster than you, right? Because you got a lot of gear on. Um, that's the only reason why he's faster than me. Yeah. <laughs> Travis got a lot of juice in his tank, though. Travis was actually committed to go to Pepperdine too, but he got offered such a great uh, you know, opportunity out of high school. I mean, he had to take it. I would have taken it too. Uh, and so he was better than you coming out of high school. Travis was better than I was uh, coming out of high school. You know, and in those games when we played those games in our driveway in our front yard, I'd say it was like 50-50 a lot of the time. Even though we were two years apart, I mean, yeah. I'd beat him sometimes, he'd beat me, and we had our own peculiar rules to make the game work with just two players one on one. Uh, it was a good time.